is 103, went up one in Newark, and that's a record breaker for them for the month. 91 degrees at Kennedy, there's LaGuardia. Now hang on, everybody. We're talking about six, seven hours before relief is in sight. Not long, give or take an hour, the midnight hour, we get it going to cooler and drier. Eventually, meaning cooler air, the drier will be a while. Uh, we do have a heat index to deal with here, but it slides. You can see after midnight down to 83 by 1 a.m. It's 12 degrees in terms of the real feel, cooler. The heaviest rain is now up and over the north of the city. It's across the reservoirs, and you can see it banging away from Dutchess to Litchfield to Dover County, all the way across to LaGrangeville, northern Dutchess, Kent, and Unionvale. And again, the heftiest thunderstorms are benchmarked all the way to the north in Delaware and Sullivan County. So the good news for us is the first round of showers misses us, but there are more showers on the way. The thunderstorm watch is just north of the city. You can see the leading edge of the front beginning to approach. It starts with a couple of scattered showers for tonight. Tomorrow early you're okay, and then scattered showers pop up, and that'll be the deal in the early afternoon hours and continue later on in the afternoon and tomorrow night, and continues again on Friday. This is of duration, and we're going to have to watch this to see where the heaviest banding sets up kind of system modeling suggesting an inch plus here in the city east and south of the city it looks like one to two inches we're on it and now we head towards the fourth all right uh you know about thursday and friday scattered showers more rain on friday saturday it looks like we try to swing the moisture out of here tapering off still could be a shower about on sunday Fireworks, okay. Next week, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday look good. More heat comes back middle latter part of next week.